Everybody likes to talk about iron sights um, being the end-all be-all when they never fail, especially when they compare them to red dots. Uh, my experience this year is I've had three iron sights and my own guns fail and three red dots fail, and Eric now has a sight that moves back and forth, which means it's really going to be hard for him to get accurate hits. He's going to have right and left problems constantly. Thank goodness he noticed it. All right, It's not a fight ender if he was in a fight, but on a training day it is. Now Eric's a smart guy, I know he's got another gun and he's I simply going to change. Yeah, he's got tools, or he can change guns and do this, but iron sights do tend to move in the dovetail. All right. If this happens to you, you need to either dimple it with a punch mm -hmm. and you need to apply some Loctite underneath it and see if that solves the problem. If not, go see your local gunsmith and they'll fit you a better one and it'll work. But just realize that iron sights do move too. Um, as a red dot shooter, I still use the iron sights to center my gun as it's coming up because my eyes have been trained to recognize that. I was shooting a, a match and I brought the gun up and I was like, man, my dot is all over the place. It's not in the right place. Well, what had happened is the same thing happened to him. My, Dovetail had slid over a little bit, my sight, so my eye said something's out of line, so it blamed the red dot. So all sights fail. <clears throat> all right, just realize that. Remember the discussion we have? Have a training gun, have a carry gun. This is why. Training gun gets beat up, no big deal, just change it out. Your carry gun gets beat up, this may happen in a fight, and you may miss and never know why. So just understand this. this is a great thing. For Rachel, she's not quite comfortable with the new sights on the borrowed gun. Sights are very personality driven how well do you see how do your eyes work what do you like you're going to go through a box of sights just like you did a box of holsters because some things won't work you'll feel like you need more information then you feel like you need less and eventually you'll realize this is exactly what i need and then i would suggest putting those on all your guns okay uh, black rear uh, fiber front or uh, trijicon style big dot or x-ray dot really the way to go um, that's what almost all the world championship shooters shoot that's a clue. They really need to see exquisitely what they're shooting, and it's a, they're able to do it under great duress and speed. So, something for you. So, Eric, thanks for letting us share this moment of your your sight moving. Cool.